What's going on guys? Dudley here and today I'm bringing you a little bit of free-for-all on standoff and uh, I actually joined this game like now I don't want to say mid-game because there's like only 30 seconds played of it but the guy I think already had two kills by the time I got in so it's I wasn't completely far behind but you know I was down two kills which I make up pretty quickly right here um, but anyways I, I was thinking a lot about next-gen consoles yesterday for whatever reason and um, the thing is I don't even know if a next gen console is worth it frankly and now I'm not I'm not here to talk bad about the next gen consoles actually I think they're pretty cool I think it's awesome that they came up with a new console the Xbox one I don't know why it's called that but that's what it's called the PS4 they know how to count but uh, nonetheless it's pretty cool that they came up with next gen consoles for both PS3 and the Xbox 360 and uh, I just said the same consoles I meant the Xbox one and the PS4 um, that's great the thing is I don't know if the difference between the current consoles and the next gen consoles is going to be enough to make me want to buy it, you know? Um, I, I looked at the features that it had and not the specifications because I don't really understand all that, all that graphics and all that stuff. I just kind of looked at what, it, what they had to offer for gaming and to be completely honest, there wasn't a lot that I said, oh wow, I, I really need that while playing. And um, Although I do know that the graphics are probably undoubtedly going to be better than they are right now. I don't know how much better, you know? Like, uh, if... The only reason I will buy an Xbox One because of the graphics is if it completely blows this out of the water. Like, the graphics that you're seeing right now, um, that's 720p. I don't really know what it looks like 1080. I've never played 1080 because I my internet isn't fast enough to upload 1080, uh, 1080p video. Uh, I'm assuming that if I did 1080p, it'd take like at least three months for me to upload a five-minute a five-minute gameplay. Uh, that's probably a massive exaggeration, but um, so yeah, I've only played in 720. I don't know what 1080p looks like, but uh, unless it completely blows this out of the water, I don't think I'm gonna be buying an X an Xbox uh, just for the graphics. Um, another thing is if the games are different, and I don't know I don't know how to explain this exactly. But uh, back when I had a PS2, which was before I had an Xbox 360, uh, I was playing Need for Speed this one day, right? And uh, I wanted to I wanted to tune my car because I think it was Need for Speed Pro Street, maybe I don't know. And uh, that has like some drag races. And if you don't know what drag is, it's uh, basically you go in a straight line, and basically whoever finishes first uh, wins. So you, you what you try to do is you try to tune your car so that your shifts are perfect. Uh, and uh, you get the most out of your engine, therefore you go faster. Um, anyway, so I was trying to tune my car, but I wasn't very good at it, so I looked it up on YouTube, and uh, I did see a game, and it was on PC. Now, I didn't really care too much about the graphics, but what I did notice was that the PC had some other options to tune your car that the uh, that the PS2 didn't, and my only, my only uh, reasoning for that was probably because it's a little bit more advanced on other consoles. So I just, you know, so that's that's my thing, like, unless the games are completely different, for example, like Call of Duty Ghosts has certain features on the Xbox One that it won't have on the Xbox, then yeah, I might consider buying it just to have, like, the complete game, but if it's going to be the exact same game, uh, then I, I don't see the point in buying it just for the graphics, unless you guys really want to see some amazing graphics, then who knows, maybe I could rob enough banks and buy myself an Xbox One. Um, but you know, whatever. Like that's that's not too big of a deal. The graphics, I feel like. Um, and to be completely honest, if if I get an Xbox One, I have to get a new HD PVR because my current HD PVR does not have an HDMI uh, cable, so I can't do that. Uh, so I have to get the new HD PVR too. Get that. That's like one hundred sixty nine dollars plus the Xbox plus the games. Uh, so you know, it'd be, I think it'd be cheaper just to buy a PC. To be completely honest, and uh, just do that. But uh, I don't know. Let me know. Let me know what you guys think about next gen consoles in the comment section below. Do you think they're worth buying? Do you think the graphics are going to be out of this world that will actually make you want to go to an next gen console? I don't know. If you guys enjoyed, let me know in the comment section below. And as always, have a great day. Peace.